Hey, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna to talk about productivity and getting things done. Now, people look at productivity as this magical potion. They think that there's some magical morning routine or some meditation or a pill or supplement or an app on their computer or phone that's gonna give them these superhuman productivity abilities. And while you can get some slight improvements from those things, and I know because I've tried all those things myself, they're only gonna give you a slight improvement and they're not gonna give you the real productivity that you're looking for. When I was testing these things out, I spent so much time trying to be more productive that I actually spent more time working and getting less done. My work days basically became longer. I was, I was working more hours, but having less and less to show for it because I was spending so much of that day trying to be more productive. But eventually I found three things, three secrets that ended up working for me to make me more productive, so that I could get more work done, make a lot more money, have a lot more fun in my life and in my business, and spend more time and have more freedom doing things that I actually wanted to do. So if you wanna learn the real secret to productivity and getting things done fast, then that's what you're gonna discover in the video today. So let's dive into those three things, three secrets right now. Number one is enjoying what you do, or at least having an interest in it. So if you hate what you do, there is nothing in the world that's gonna make you more productive. And this was the case when I was working a nine to five as a project manager, I hated my job. And I spent half the day watching videos and hiding in conference rooms and trying to avoid doing the work because I just hated my job so much. So there's nothing you could have given me. You couldn't have paid me more money to be more productive in that job. I still would have found ways to not do the work because I hated what I was doing. Now, the same thing happened when I had my e-commerce stores, right? So I loved working on my e-commerce stores when I first started. This was back in 2015, 2016. It gave me the opportunity to quit my job as a project manager, which I definitely hated. But after two years of running my stores and selling these cheap knockoff products from China, I didn't really enjoy doing it anymore. And because of that, the sales and the performance of my stores started to drop. So this is probably the most important part about being productive is actually enjoying what you do or having some kind of interest in it. If you hate what you do, you're not going to be productive. There's nothing you can do to change that. So make sure that you are working on something that you enjoy doing or you, you at least have an interest in. The second thing is to give yourself constraints. So Abraham Lincoln has a famous saying, it goes something like, if you gave me eight hours to chop down a tree, I would spend six hours sharpening the ax. Now, some people look at that as preparation. That's the way they translate it. But I look at it as procrastination. So the truth is work expands to the time that you give it. If I gave myself two hours to write an email, I'm going to take the full two hours to write that email. If I give myself 30 minutes and I put a timer on, I'm going to get that entire email done in 30 minutes, that same email. So give yourself constraints. And I've seen this as a pattern throughout my entire life as well. From grade school until college, I would have two months to study for a test and I'd spend that entire two months just farting around and just fooling around. And by the time that the test came, it was the day before and I would cram an entire nights of studying into that one day, one to two days. So the secret here is to give yourself constraints so that you actually get your work done in a reasonable time period and you're not spending all that time just fooling around. The third productivity secret is to batch your work. It takes a ton of brain power to focus and refocus your brain on all these different tasks. And if you spend your day going through a task list of 10 different things, you're not gonna get much done. So I'd highly recommend that you batch your work. So for example, the way that I do this, like right now is Friday, I spend all of my Fridays shooting two YouTube videos and editing those videos. Friday is YouTube day. On Mondays, I spend two hours writing and scheduling out my tweets for the week. So I use a tool called Hype Theory, and I go into Hype Theory for two hours every Monday, usually in the evenings, and I type out and schedule my tweets as much as I can for the entire week. And it's usually four tweets a day. For sales calls, I'm only taking them on Monday, Wednesday, Friday in the afternoons from like two to 5 p.m. Pacific time. And on Tuesday and Thursdays, I'm doing deep product development or creative work like copywriting and sales pages and funnels. So by batching my work into days like this, into theme days, I'm able to move a lot faster and get a lot more done so that I'm not switching between these things every day. So by batching it into themed days like this, I'm able to focus on the work for the specific day and I don't have to switch gears every day. So if you can imagine, if I had to do my creative work, like my copywriting and product development and my sales calls and my, my content creation around my tweets and my YouTube videos and editing all in the same day, I probably would not get that much done. So that's the third secret is to batch all of your similar work into themed days so you're not hopping around and switching gears every day and you're able to focus on the actual tasks for each day. So those are my three real secrets to productivity and getting more work done fast. Number one was in actually enjoying what you do. Number two is to give yourself constraints, give yourself 
time limits for getting work done. And number three is to batch similar work together so that you can actually focus on getting that work done on the specific days. So if you apply these three productivity secrets to your life, you're gonna get more work done fast, you're gonna make more money, and have more freedom and time to spend your days how you actually want. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a like and subscribe if you're not already. Also, if you wanna learn a money-making skill in your spare time and all this extra time that you're gonna have back, Go to emailrainmaker.com. That's going to take you to my free Facebook group about how to write emails that sell and get paid for it. So go to emailrainmaker.com. That's going to take you directly to the group where you can join for free. So that's it for this video around productivity. I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.